James O'Keefe of Project Veritas has dropped an absolute bombshell today on Twitter, as well as the Project Veritas website, which I highly suggest you go and check out after this video. The video on Twitter has racked up almost a million views, and probably way over that by the time I get to press play. But let's take a look. You know, I'm here. You chose a Republican, not a Democrat, right? That's, can I do this? You can, do, you can go to wherever you want, but our conversation that we had, you said you were voting for a hater because you were going straight Democrat. So that way you are voting for the straight Dem. Is that what you want to do, correct? Can I do it like that? I don't know. Well, I, I didn't want it all in the show you. So you're going to, you're going to dot that in, and the line goes like this, and then your initials are going to put right there. So that way they know it was done accidental. She didn't vote for who we wanted her to vote for. No, no. That right there is against the law for me to tell her, like, you realize you voted for... You can't really You're not sway supposed to like say that. nothing. Oh, and she's going to say, man, Motto sent you this badass shawl. Uh, you know what? Yeah. I couldn't vote for him, but you're in his area. You vote for him. Yeah. This is it's what you call flipping people. Flipping people. What I do in picking up the balance when he was with me, that's illegal. I could go to jail. So I, I'm a little apprehensive to tell somebody, you know what I'm doing, you know what I'm saying? And again, once he works with me once, he's gonna say she's... I, I guess Trump was right. <laughs> I'm sorry. About doing shit illegal? I'm sorry? About doing stuff illegal? Yeah. <laughs> They all said he was full of shit. Oh, hell no, he's not. It's true. Because yeah. you're not supposed to do that. If I have a bunch of them, mm -hmm. I'll take 20 here, 30 here, 40 here. Oh, the mix of them, not the same post office. Of course not. Yeah. So because I told her to vote for Hager, so I'm going to take a picture of her, mm -hmm. take a picture of the ballot where mm -hmm. it says them two on there, mm -hmm. take a picture of you in the background so they know that you are freaking there. Mm -hmm. Take a picture of us all together, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to send it to you, and you do not let anybody else know this is what I'm doing, because I would, if I go to prison, I do not look cute in stripes, I'm and I will hate you forever. Again, this is only part of the uh, video. You have to go to the website here. Project Veritas. Check out the full transcript. He has a full 20-minute video here. It's disgusting. And, you know, the ironic thing or the absolutely insane thing is, is this Raquel Rodriguez works for the GOP House candidate Mario Garza. So while she's getting paid to work for Mario Garza and the GOP, she is out there harvesting ballots, bribing people to change their vote, as well as uh, there was a, I think there was another uh, point in the story where she basically paid for buckets of beers. She gets people down to the bar. She makes sure, you know, she gets them to vote properly before she uh, lets them get hammered. Here it is. Uh, let's see. She says she hosts parties f at a bar for her voters, some of them former inmates recruited by her colleague. I mean, this story goes on forever, but uh, I'm going to cut this video short. I'm going to leave a link to this article as well as the Twitter link uh, in the video description. Thanks again.